Hello everyone, this is Latified, and today I'm going to be doing a very simple tutorial on how to do shiny text. What this is going to do is going to make your text look much more professional and it's going to make it pop out. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up Photoshop, we're going to press File, New. We'll just do an 800 by 800 size document. And we're going to press OK. We're going to just make a black background and get our text tool out. And just going to write whatever you like, Latified and then we're just going to press out of that now what we're going to do is we're going to get the rectangular marquee tool out what you want to do is right click and press rectangular marquee tool if you don't have it ready you're going to make a rectangle it should be in the middle of the text and up now we're going to press control shift n or layer new layer and we're going to press ok now what we're going to do is right click inside the rectangle that you make you're going to press fill and then for contents use you're going to press white and you're just going to press ok now you want to do is click on the rectangle to get the marquee out and you're going to lower the opacity to around let's do 37 now what you're going to do is you're going to press on your text layer you're going to press your brush tool just to rasterize the layer click anywhere press ok now what we're going to do is we're going to select using the magic wand tool outside of our text tool outside of our text sorry make sure you're clicking on the text layer and we're gonna press shift hold shift anywhere where you have circles inside your text so like on the A's, the E's, the D's, the P's, anything like that now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your layer where you made the rectangle and you're gonna press delete on it what that's gonna do is gonna delete the excess white and you're going to be left with a beautiful glow. So everyone, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my tutorial. Remember to subscribe for more. Thank you.